Over the last 10 years, you've shared your stories and experiences with us, good and bad. You've told us what's working and what isn't when it comes to health and social care. With your help, we've been able to improve services for everyone. But nothing would have changed if local people hadn't spoken up about their care and services hadn't listened. To mark our first decade, we want to celebrate Health Watch heroes who've championed change over the last 10 years, resulting in better health and care. Kerry Sumner has worked with Health Watch Norfolk since it began, helping to advise and support the organisation as the County Council's Director of Community Information and Learning, and more recently as Norfolk Fire Service's Chief Fire Officer and Director. This has meant helping with a wide range of the organisation's projects. Well, it's so far ranging, the amount of different areas that Health Watch get involved in. And primarily, of course, they are there to represent the voice of users of health and social care across Norfolk and, and particularly to have a voice for those um, seldom heard groups or groups that might not usually be picked up in, in terms of looking at requirements and, and needs for service. Um, so, so there's that side of things but also I think the proactive and innovative work Health Watch have done to take forward information provision, making sure that people are aware of their own health, where they can access services, the signposting side of things, um, I think they've really made great strides around that. This has encompassed a wide range of different areas of health and care and Kerry highlights some of the projects she supported us with and which we helped supply data and feedback to for decision makers. During the pandemic, the, the Health Watch team were incredibly proactive. They, they joined in some of the wider public sector networks of how do we support our most vulnerable residents, how do we get information to them, and how do we help people make sense of all of the different messages that were out there during that time. Um, and also some really proactive work in, uh, to support groups with different language requirements. Um, and again, that carried through when we had our Ukrainian guests coming to live in Norfolk. Health Watch were one of the first organisations to translate a whole range of health information into Ukrainian and, and related languages so that people could understand that and access those, those vital services as they came to the country. But I know there's also been some really fantastic work over the years around looking into the needs of veterans, the needs of um, disabled service users um, and, and particularly outcomes for um, uh, looked after children and uh, adopted children are, are some of the things that spring to mind immediately. In the last year, Health Watch Norfolk and Norfolk Fire and Rescue Service have also forged closer links to share and distribute safety information. Um, I uh, joined Norfolk Fire and Rescue just over a year ago now, a uh, fantastic organisation to be part of and very privileged to, to have the role of Chief Fire Officer um, and realised straight away how we could utilise some of the um, existing capabilities of Health Watch and the networks to, to really promote some of the wider messages around safety and wellbeing, again for our more vulnerable residents, those that are more at uh, risk of fire, um, uh, maybe have mobility issues, that maybe are having care support within the home and, and looking at how we could really get those messages out to people and, and extend our work there. So you know, really happy to be able to continue that relationship with Health Watch and, and utilise the, the skills and, and the tools that you have available. A wide range of work and Kerry's been a vital bridge between Health Watch Norfolk and other organisations ensuring a free flow of data which can, in turn, help enhance and improve services for the people of Norfolk, which is why we named her a Health Watch hero. I'm, I was uh, surprised and delighted to, uh, to be named as a Health Watch hero, absolutely wasn't expecting it, but very honoured um, to, to get the award, um, you know, worked with Alex and the team from day one pretty much when Health Watch was set up um, back, back in the day um, and it's been great to be part of that journey to see the evolution and to see the, the strength uh, of, of Health Watch na nationally but also the proactive approach taken here in Norfolk. Without your stories, good and bad, we couldn't affect change where it matters most. Whether you spoke to us at an event, over the phone or left a comment online, we want to let you know it mattered. Thank you.